Oh, he'll be fine. <laughs> What's going on guys? As you can tell, today's episode is a little bit different, quite a bit funny, and I am here to make a public service announcement. Man, Devin and I are cruising through Round Rock on our way down to Austin, Texas for a little mini series for you guys over the next couple days. Gonna be filming a lot, still uploading one video a day, better believe it. But I have some big news. The boat, man, our new bass boat the deposit has been made it is in we are driving out of state to pick that thing up tuesday i'm literally finishing this video up on our drive down to austin sunday may 10th right now and so only a couple more days as soon as we get back from here we're headed out east to go pick that bad boy up you guys got a lot to look forward to in the next few videos stay tuned man it's going to be a blast but let's not delay on today's video any longer Welcome back gang, guess what it is? The weekend, man, Saturday, May 9th. We are out here, we're gonna fish with John B and Alex Perrick today, gonna have a ton of fun. I drove downtown for this one, man. I got rods in here, I think I'm late, so I'm gonna get the GoPro strap up, gear up, tell you guys what we're throwing today, but we're at a popular spot that has been uh, producing well lately, so let's go ahead and get after these fish. Yo, well, just seeing if y'all are at the spot or not yet. I'm hoping to have a couple on the bank by the time y'all get here, then if I got a 10 minute advantage. All right, there's a little spot for margaritas here if y'all ain't had enough yet. They should be here any minute. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get to cranking first, I think, today, and skip out on the uh, craw for just a moment. All right, I think this is the Grande Banger. Um, yeah, three to seven foot diver, but I'm up on this elevation here. I know I'm not gonna get no seven feet out of this thing, but hopefully I will get a bass. Rod tip is not close to the water, but guess what? If these fish are chasing today, I got a feeling it's gonna be lights out. Gotta get low to the water, man. Get a little depth out of this thing, try and hit the bottom. Try not to get snagged, but try and hit the bottom. That's always the the struggle. Coming up on a different facing wall from the wind, a little shade over here, could produce some different results. Maybe break out that pre-release bait real fast. Exopod, see what's up. Good, how are you doing? What kind of fish do you catch out here? Uh, I'm going for bass, but I, I know there's some more stuff in here. Yeah, what do you use, like uh, artificial uh, Artificial little... Uh, yeah, just uh, crankbait, crawls and whatnot, are working well. Yeah, that's the fishing license is all. Yeah, of course. Have a good one. All right, no fish. We're switching it up, guys, to the pre-release exopod right here. This thing's been doing some work in a recent outing. Uh, gonna give this thing a little shot. This is a three-aught hook right here. You guys normally see me throwing the uh, bigger, beefier four or five-aughts with my larger baits. This hook suits this guy perfectly. And uh, it's got this little indention right here for your hook to kind of rest and remain weedless. Uh, but yesterday I was fishing these upside down and on this side, it's actually pretty good to text pose your hook in there if you're fishing thick cover. So we'll see if this works out best or if I'm gonna wanna rig it essentially upside down again. And uh, I bet you would get bites on this man. They're not seeming to hit the crank, but this should do the trick. Oh, had him. Fix that up. Got him. There we go. First one of the day. Halfway decent, guys. Probably two pounds. That's what we're talking about. On the exopod, man. Yes. Come here, kid. All right, dude, what happened to you? What is going on? This is a mutant bass right here. Yeah, about uh, closing in on two pounds, man. Nice little fatty three-aught hook. Exopod, newly released bait, man. I think you guys can get those early June. Check him out. First one of the day. That is what we are talking about right there. Healthy little chunk. All right, hitting on the bottom baits. Let's go. See you, bud. I uh, just caught one a minute ago. Nice. Cool. What kind of fish you catch? <laughs> I'm going for bass. Oh, nice. Yes, sir. Cool. There's something. Little guy? I can't tell. Dang it. He let it go. <laughs> no way. <laughs> no, he didn't break it out. <laughs> Injury prone. Uh, so how are you doing? <laughs> I got a feeling it's gonna end in the uh, end up in the water here in a minute. Like <laughs> yeah, dude. I, I see you have a big Garmin unit on yours now, so yeah. I assume you're using it. I've got a 10 inch on the front, the front of my phone. That's what we're gonna get, dude, because it's like five grand for a 16, 12. Yeah, I don't you, know. You don't need it's it like all. five grand. T 10 inch is fine. Yeah. Wait Whoa! a minute. Hold it. No way. Oh! My God. oh! <laughs> Dude, your thumbnail. Like, so Harry's on a skateboard. John's on the first fish. Oh my god. Dude, that was insane. That was sick. <laughs> I thought that was your lure hitting the water. Boom. I feel like you're the master at boarding. Ah, uh, maybe, maybe back in the day. I don't know about anymore. <laughs> we'll have to see if there's a little stair set around here. <laughs> this could be his most watched video. 
Perk, you set the hook on nothing there? It's not gone. Yeah. Perk's been setting the hook on every rock down here. <laughs> the results are in. <laughs> so I'm fishing and someone literally just leaves their rod out here. I don't even know what's going on. Oh, it's Tony Hawk's Pro Skater. <laughs> Perk has given up on life. <laughs> Let me see this thing. I gotta see if I can like even do an ollie. <laughs> Let me see. Okay. Oh god. Dude, this is this is like not the easiest ground to get around on. <laughs> it's going into the water. Woo! Oh god! He's got the moves. <laughs> oh, don't go in the water now. That's okay, reserved for the skateboard. <laughs> do it for the fans! <laughs> my first day ever skateboarding. Just Ooh. <laughs> Remind you to tighten those trucks up, they're a little wobbly. And this ground is not the easiest to skate on, by the way. When the fish aren't biting... <laughs> oh, please. Oh, <laughs> this guy is legit. Austin Smith is legit. Oh, God. That all I got. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Buddy, just brought you snag your jig on it. It'll, it'll probably break you off, too. <laughs> Oh, uh, Perrick. Uh. <laughs> that was awesome. So Perrick was so excited, he just bought the skateboard. <laughs> He's got his socks. Tony Hawk lost his board. It's right there. We'll find it. Yeah, I was gonna say, well, it's we'll not going anywhere. <laughs> Wait, didn't John say he bought one too? You could just go get that out of the car. Close to do this. It's got to be. Right there, I feel it. There it is, right there. <laughs> Sock game 100. Oh, that's a sock? Yeah. <laughs> Dumbass. Yeah. Alright, now swim across the lake. I found your skateboard. All the way over there. Triple back. When you lose your favorite color, crack and crawl. <laughs> I hope you find. Oh, yeah, he's fine. Yeah, he's fine. Woo! Oh, look, his rod's still over there. And y'all, it was about that time John and Parrot took off. Got to get his clothes into the dryer. <laughs> I think they had some plans later that evening. I stuck around though. Ended up catching another fish, you guys. Here we go. One crawl left. All right, let's see if the crawl makes a big difference. This should do the trick right here. All right, maybe the last pit stop. Check this thing out. Hmm. Oh, well, there's frogs. Look at this spot. This looks like a fluke spot. Dang, little bait fish cruising. All right, I doubt this ever gets fished. Yeah, I don't know if there's bass in here or not. I'm walking the bank almost purposefully trying to spook anything that would be up shallow just to see if I can gauge if there's any fish in here, some movement. Certainly do not see any. All right, well, back to the car. Got him. All right, there we go. And that's what I'm talking about. Deep man in the middle today, guys. What do we got on here? Oh, he's all right. That's what I'm talking about. Come on up here. Woo! Crack and crawl, baby. Killing it. Black and blue color. That's what's up, boys. That one took a few casts out here in the back. I haven't ever fished this area before. I was fishing the main lake. Seems like they're tucked away in these little back pockets, man. Crack and crawl tearing them up. Let's get it. Yo, that's a fatty, probably like a two pounder. I didn't know if he was big or not, but that's what's up, man. Healthy fish back here. Get him back in the water. See you, bud. Well, y'all, that absolutely wraps up an eventful evening with the Guggen members over here. Now I see why there's so many no swimming signs in this place. Uh, thanks to Parrot. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a fun one guys. Don't forget one upload a day. Go ahead subscribe if you're not already. We'll see you tomorrow <gasps>